Hi guys, Skip here. Uh, got a little unboxing here, a little surprise. Uh, this was sent to us by our, fen by our friends at uh, Veloga Fun Hobby. Uh, you can get them through Amazon. These are those little flashing uh, LED lights that I was using. Uh, they liked the video and stuff that I did. It helped them sell quite a few. By the way, guys, the uh, uh, flashing LEDs are back in stock at, uh, as of the time of this video. These flashing LEDs are back in stock. Um, so you can order them on Amazon. They're about $31, $32 a, a set. And uh, they come in a, a package. Uh, here, let me open this up for you. Hold on a second. I have to get the camera. Is that still? There we go. Uh, wow, they packed it pretty good. Anyway, this uh, company was nice enough uh, after taking a look at the video. You know, I told them I, uh, basically that I had done this video and that they sold out right away on Amazon. They said, yeah, so you're the ones basically that, that did that. So they sent me three sets of these. I, I, I made an idea that I might have a, uh, a little promotional giveaway on my channel, which uh, I think I may do here. Uh, I was going to keep another set for myself anyway, but they sent me one set and they sent me two extras. Uh, and asked that maybe I could make a, a, uh, a video uh, show, doing a demonstration on these things. I guess there was a couple of questions raised and they get some returns where people are improperly uh, hooking them up to when they charge. So first of all, let's open up the box and you see you get the three flashing lights. And they all work, right? Beautiful. Okay, turn them all off. Um, underneath the box, see if I can get this out here easily enough. I can still keep the camera in focus. Boy, this, they're protected in here, I'll tell you that. And a real nice little packaging case for these things. Um, so they, they come out like this. My hand's shaking a little bit this morning. I just had a big cup of coffee and no breakfast yet. So, excuse me. And now I'm tapping the back of the camera so I can see what I'm looking at here again. So, uh, in the box you see you got, you got some stickers here. And those are for the bottoms of the things you can use these or discard these and use the uh, Velcro or, or the hook loop, the hook latch like I use. Uh, it comes with a little adapter power cable. Um, I'm going to show you a little trick, I think, or, or I hope I can. But this should be able to plug into the, the battery at this end here. And then this you could put on an actual little tester uh, to test the battery voltage. Because remember, inside these things, guys, are little LiPo cells. They're little one-cell LiPos. So you want to keep an eye on the, on the charge on those things, too. You don't want to always keep them overcharged and then just let them sit. You won't get the, you know, the life expectancy out of a LiPo. So treat them like LiPos in there. Uh, what I did when I first initially got the set was I checked the voltage to see what their uh, start-off voltage was per cell. And, you know, then I gave it maybe about 15 minutes of a charge on each one because I knew I was only going to fly the plane two or three times. Um, so I didn't even give them a full charge the first time around. So uh, uh, that's something to keep in mind here, guys. I don't know that it would really hurt it. You know, one cells seem to last and seem to be a little bit more durable like that. Um, when you do that to them, but uh, you know, I don't advise it. I don't advise it. Anyway, the question here, uh, one guy said he couldn't, and I won't bring up many names because it could be embarrassing. Um, one guy had a problem finding the charge port. Well, it's right on the back, and it's right on the back in here. Okay? And if you look very, very closely, let's see if I can get the right lighting here for you guys. Uh, let's see, pick one with a color. Here we go, got a red one here. And I'll see if I can't get that in, into focus. But right on the back there, it is marked plus and minus. Now, it would be cool if they had a, uh, uh, if that opening only fit a certain way with this connector, but it doesn't. The connector is square. Okay, so you have to watch your polarity, plus and minus, and make sure it, 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 it lines up with the polarity on the back of the plug. You notice that the minus is always on the inside towards the button. So your black wire is always going to go to the inside toward the button as such. Okay. 
noting the polarity, I can see it. I hope you guys can see this. There's a plus on this side. There's a little minus on that side. So that tells me I want the, the black wire over there. Excuse me one second here. There we go. Yeah. So you put the black wire in there like that. There goes the camera again. <laughs> uh, so you put the black wire towards the button. Now you got proper polarity. Now if you hook this up to another another power source of something, say you're charging it out in the field, or you're using this for your tester, you can put this on the tester. You'll get your battery voltage. Okay. Now again, to charge the unit is the same way. Watch your polarity minus towards the middle okay and then this plugs into a power source if you got a, a USB cable you know like you use to uh, charge your, your cell phone it's the same size mini USB cable uh, a mini USB cable to a USB as you see I've got over there and if you hold tight here I'll grab a cable. okay I've grabbed a cable here and I've got a little portable power unit here that I've got I use out in the field I can plug a charger or anything AC I want into it or run DC or I can USB in this case we're gonna go USB and then uh, no more than a one amp charge on this guys it won't handle any more than an amp so make sure it's like a phone charger okay and this simply just plugs in one way it can only go one way the light will come on okay now the light stays on until it turns blue once it turns blue you got a full charge I only left these batteries on originally now this is fresh out of the box I'm not going to give them a full charge but this is for demonstration purposes once this light is, is fully charged it'll turn blue and that takes about 20 to 30 minutes per item okay hope this video clears things up for you guys again remember polarity and it is marked negative towards the button guys all right Thanks for watching. Thank you, Vologa Family Fun, for uh, supporting this channel and uh, promoting the uh, giveaway here that we're going to be announcing pretty soon. Okay? Thanks for watching.